The family of a Tennessee State University student wants to know what led up to their daughter's death. Yeah, Mia Kanu's body was found lying on a Michigan road after a house party. Police say they are investigating it now as a homicide. WSMV's Marissa Sulik spoke with Kanu's mother today about why she was in Michigan and the questions they still have about her death. She loved all animals and everything living. Mia Kanu dreamt of being a veterinarian. She was studying to be one at TSU and worked at Richland Animal Clinic. She didn't want to leave for the summer, but her mom, Bianca Van Meter, says rent was too high. She just loved the people and loved the animals. And I told her, you cannot sleep in your car. You have to come home. Mia went home to Michigan, where she started hanging out with new friends. Her mom says one girl stayed at their home a few nights. The friend made Van Meter uncomfortable, so she asked Mia for her vehicle registration if it was going to be parked in her driveway. The night that the incident happened, my daughter sent me a picture of the girl's registration. Van Meter says it was the same car Mia was in the night she was found. She was in her car. Nobody went back for my daughter. She was left in the middle of the road. Um, no one called 911. This week, her mom was there as her daughter donated her organs. Mia saved a baby and another recipient, offering care to families even in her death. The messages I'm getting from people in high school who were thinking that their life was pretty much over, and then they met my daughter. And that, to me, so many stories like that. Now, police in Michigan are investigating this as a homicide, and they see the people involved and the driver are cooperating. In Nashville, Marissa Sulek, WSMV4.